Um, so yeah, I just saw him overthrow it and I made sure I, had to make sure I collected it and caught it and then try to get as much as I can. What was the moment like with the defense where that was the first interception of the year for you guys? I mean, it was good. I mean, I'm glad it happened. Both we wish we had some more, you know, in this game, but I mean, it's good to get that in. I'm always going to try and think I can house it for sure, but uh, they got me out of bounds. Yeah. The final drive where they got the touchdown pass to Pippen, it looked like LJ had a coverage on that. Is that just kind of you chalk it up to that's what Pippen I mean, that's what, it, that's, what it, that's what happens in football. Sometimes they win, sometimes you win. I mean, you can be in good position and you could be just an inch off and they catch it. So, I mean, he was in position, they just made a play. Um, it was very frustrating. I mean, we felt like we were getting the stops, and then we see a yellow flag come in. Um, so it was definitely frustrating. We felt like we played good ball. Um, we coached, you know, good techniques. So I mean, the calls are just not falling our way this game. Coming off that opening drive for the Colts, how do you feel like you guys settled in as a defense? Um, we settled in pretty good. Um, you know, we got to get off the field after that first drive. Um, got a turnover. Uh, we're putting a little pressure, um, but we just got to keep making sure we do that throughout the whole four quarters. Amani, we've been a leader in this locker room on this team for a while. How important is it to kind of keep this team, you know, focused early mm -hmm. on still in the season? Um, it's very important. Uh, we don't have you know, any other breaks coming up to, to reflect or whatever, so guys got to come back to work tomorrow and fix whatever needs to be fixed and just focus on the little things. Do you feel like... Obviously, a couple, couple of tough road games coming up. I know mm -hmm. we're all tough in this league, but what, did, what has to be the mindset for you guys You know, at, with the record that you have right now? Um, just be a dog. Bring that dog with you. Um, don't don't get too conservative because the way things aren't going our way. Um, you got to show up and be a professional and be a pro and do your job. So if you're going to go out there and you know do your job on a consistent basis, then you know, you'll put someone else out there. How about some of the, the throws from the company today? Mm -hmm. say the last thing to call the quarterback is the arm. Yeah. Tight yeah, yeah, he was putting the ball out there. Um, you know, they he was doing a good job of just being a being a veteran. You know, what I mean, being a veteran quarterback. Um, we tried to mix up some disguises. Um, we got him sometimes. Sometimes he got us. But I mean, at the end of the day, I felt like we played good as a defense. But you know, it's tough when the drives get extended. Um, it make, makes it seem like we didn't play as good. But I felt like overall we did play good. How do you think this group can play complementary football on a consistent basis? Um, everyone just do their job. I mean, if we just do our job, defense, special teams does their job, offense do their job then it starts to, to mesh and flow. So, I mean, at the end of the day, just come to work, get better. If you don't get better, then they're going to put someone else out there to, to do it. Um, the activation was always, you know, a blessing. And uh, we've been working nonstop with all the guys. But, uh, you know, it's not a good way, not, not a good day right now. They definitely don't like to lose. When did you find out you were going to be starting today? Um, earlier in the week. I don't remember the exact day. I really don't. But earlier in the week. Yeah. How, how tough is it to come out and, you know, play your butts off? the way you did for four quarters and come up short today? Um, it just hurts because we know how good of a team we are as a whole. We know how much, uh, how hard we work and how much we know we can really shock this league and do a lot of things. So it hurts a lot to uh, not get it done. We've been in a lot of close ass games and it hurts not to get it done. Those last couple of drives, did Indy do anything defensively that you guys weren't expecting? Um, no, they did a phenomenal job. Their front exactly is what we thought it was. They're a great group, um, a lot of energy and a lot of um, pressure. but. Uh, we just didn't execute on offense, didn't make enough plays. One and four, obviously, you've got a couple of tough road games coming up. Uh, how do you guys, I guess from a mental standpoint, kind of circle the wagons and stay focused? Uh, same thing we've been doing all year. We know who we are. We know how hard we're going to work. We're going to go back to work tomorrow, correct the shit, wipe it away, and get ready. Yeah, I mean, it's frustrating. Um, got them there. Just let, you know, let that one slip through our hands, and we just got to be better. It's frustrating, though. Jarius looked like he had really good coverage on Pittman, yeah. but uh, you know that's kind of what Pittman does, isn't it? Right. Yeah, they get paid too. Um, yeah. They get paid, you know, good money too. So they got to go make plays on their side, and he has to do the same thing. And we know majority of the time, uh, Snead's gonna come through. And today, you know, they made a play. That's all it is. We got to move on and you know go out there and stop him like we did on the drives after. Mm -hmm. um, what did you think of the way Flacco played today? It seemed like, you know, just being the veteran that he is, standing in the pocket, making the throws. Yeah, I mean, he just put the ball where – and I, to be honest, I don't know. He just was putting the ball in the, in the empty zones or whatever the case may be, and their receivers were making plays. Um, he wasn't doing nothing too crazy. It feels, I think, for all of us that the better team didn't win today. Is that kind of how you guys – No. Yeah, we let that one slide. Um, but credits to them, they came out, they executed the game plan that they they had, and they came out with the win, and we we didn't finish once again. One and four, obviously not where you want to be. 
a couple of rough road games coming up. Mm -hmm. what, how do you guys kind of circle the wagons and just kind of stay with it mentally? You got to, because um, I mean, one and four is bad. One and five is even worse. So, got to figure this out. Got to uh, got to figure out what we can do to to be to get wins. And I mean, we're right there. We're just not capitalizing, and other teams are.